Hi everyone, my name is Joe Crozier and I'm the creator of the Back and Track app. The Back and Track app is an app for musicians who wish to learn to solo better. It's available on the App Store right now for only 99 cents. Rather than explain to you exactly what the app does, it makes a lot more sense if I just show you. So I've got an iPhone 4S right here and um, I'm going to do it on the phone here but you'll be able to see in the top corner. So all I do is launch the app and as you can see I'm agreed with a set of 10 different, uh, 10 different tracks. So let's say I want to solo over smooth jazz in the key of F with a tempo of 120. Uh, first I tap the track that I want, and then I tap in the left corner to choose my key, and I tap in the right corner to choose my tempo. Once I have those set, all I do is press the play button, and it begins to play. Now, of course the idea is that you're meant to have an instrument along with you when you play it, uh, so you can solo over it. Pretty simple. So as of February, the app's currently loaded with 10 different tracks, each in 12 different keys and 4 different tempos, totaling 480 possible tracks. Because there's so many of them, it wouldn't really make sense to store them all on the device, so the app actually fetches them from my website, jokeworkersoftware.com. Uh, it stores the downloaded tracks in a cache on the device, uh, so that can be cleared pretty easily. Uh, you just press the options button in the bottom right, and um, press delete cache tracks. Also on that same page, there's uh, the help button, and uh, that'll just bring you over to a tutorial on how to use the app. So naturally, uh, no video like this would be complete without a real demonstration. So uh, I've got my tenor sax here, and uh, I don't know if you can hear it or not, but we've got the 12 bar blues in the key of B flat with a tempo of 120 playing in the background. And uh, I'm going to be doing some improv for you. So I apologize in advance, uh, I'm a much better app writer than I am saxophone player, but um, we'll give it a shot. So I forgot to mention earlier, but additional information on each track can be found by tapping the info button on the bottom left, and uh, that'll bring up a little page with uh, the track's name, um, the progression that the track uses, the best scales to use, and also the chords used um, relative to the key you're in. So thanks a lot for watching everyone, and uh, enjoy the app.